tranquility. Yep. Oh, tranquility. Uh huh. Tranquility. Yeah, I'm here. We need you to stay where you are. Oh, okay. Please do not move. Okay, sorry about that. You so are safe here. You are, are safe. Who? You are safe here. We need you to stay where you are. Please do not move. What you are you? Are safe here. I don't think I am safe. Hey! Okay, I'm. Just... Stay where you are. Stay calm. Nah, I'm not calm. And we will recover you shortly. Nah, I'm good, dude. I'm going back to my my spacecraft. Where's this beautiful music coming from? Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. We're close. We are close. We are close. We are close. Okay, come on. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Bleat, and tonight we're playing Apollo. Mm, that's not it. We're playing Something Happened. That's not it either. Something bad is on the moon. Hey guys, my name is Bleat, and tonight we're playing Something Bad is on the Moon. Hope you guys enjoy. Is that right? Is that the name of this game? Something Bad is on the Moon. Yeah, that's it. Just want to make sure I didn't look like an idiot. All right, start recording. December 19th, 1972 marked the date of last publicly disclosed moon landing. Since then, eight classified lunar missions were authorized in absolute secrecy. I found the video recording which instigated those classified missions. Something is on the moon. Not just something. Something bad, apparently. And somehow when I saw this footage last, footage last week, I think it noticed me. Recorded December 20th, 1972, final public lunar mission, Lieutenant Marcus Rins, Rins Helm Cam footage. Tranquility base, this is Houston. You are go for EVA. Please confirm status of your suit systems and PLSS before proceeding to the equipment site. Over. By the way, guys, I, um... Roger that, Houston. This is Tranquility. Oh, this is so cool. Suit systems are green across the board. PLSS is operating within nominal parameters. Preparing to egress the LM. Over. This is really cool. Copy Tranquility. Take your first steps carefully. The radar receiver at radar site November has recently failed. Its last telemetry sweep before your EVA noted a transient signal. 1,500 miles southwest of your position. Likely a sensor echo. Proceed with manual receiver reset. Over. Huh. Understood, Houston. Oh. Theory out here. Reminds me of my last walk on the lunar surface. The solitude. The silence. You know, the human brain craves faces. And this solitude makes me see them in the hills. Moving towards the waypoint now. What do you say? That solitude makes people crave faces? Copy tranquility. It's funny, Apollo 11 was the only mission where no one said they saw faces in the rock. Must be hard to think about anything else when you're the first people to ever touch the moon, I suppose. Ever since then, someone on every lunar mission has mentioned it. Over. Mentioned faces in the rocks. Copy. Houston. I'll make sure to inform you if any little green men pop out of the ground and eat me. Until then, though, I'm en route to the radio installation. Over and out. First of all, this looks really cool. Really different than a lot of the other games I've played. A, a lot of these indie indie games I've played looks different. The setting's definitely way different. Um, really like it. Looks really good. Um, also, I know that poll I put up that asked you guys which horror game style you guys like the most. Um, what, when it went up, you guys voted that you liked the VHS um, Unreal. The really realistic looking ones and i know this one isn't quite realistic looking i know we i took that poll did the poll and it looks like i completely disregarded what you guys voted for that however is not the case i will try to focus a little bit more on i can run i yeah I, why am i not running uh i'm not running because i want to take my time and talk to you guys so i am going to try to focus a little bit more on horror games that are more realistic that you know maybe are made with unreal engine 5 and stuff um, but tonight I just didn't have a whole lot of time to record. I've had a really busy week um, And so I just didn't have the time and uh, actually right now my little man's taking a nap my little boy And so I'm trying to race against the clock a little bit to get a recording out to you guys because I really did not want to take two weeks off um, I, I honestly I started, oh, this is so cool. I'm floating. I didn't want to take more than a week off to get a video out to you guys because um I appreciate all of you very much and you guys, you know, tagging alongside me and, and hanging out and watching my stuff. It means so much to me. 
And also, um, I missed it. I really enjoy, really, really, really enjoy uh, making making videos um, that hopefully you guys enjoy. And so, passion is still very much there. And so, I missed it. And I wanted to, I just want to get something out to you guys. So. Tranquility, be advised, another lunar radar installation, 2300 miles east. Reported a brief unidentified object crossing the lunar horizon, then went dark. Similar profile to your anomaly. It's puzzling, but proceed as planned. Over. I'm having a hard time hearing what these guys are saying. Copy. When I reach the radar, I'll make an assessment of the receiver's functionality. Tell me, though, what is believed to be the source of the radar signatures? Over. Copy tranquility. Current theory is high velocity micrometeoroid, or possibly debris. Anomalous, but not unprecedented. Maintain focus on your objective. Over. So I can zoom in. Roger that, Houston. I have to admit that this situation has put me a bit on edge. I think I've been seeing things that aren't really there. Maybe just reflections off my visor. I just keep staring at the hills. Over. Huh. Tranquility. We are confident that the mission state is nominal. Stay calm and focus on fixing the receiver. You'll get some rest soon. So Update us when you reach the radar site. Over and out. So I'm just supposed to fix a receiver. Is that it? Is that what I understand? Um, why does it make this noise whenever I zoom in? That's weird. Anyway, um, all right, let's just go. Let's just go. I wanted to get to the top of this hill so I could jump off and float some more. I feel like I say this a lot, that I comment on a game being unique and whatever. I mean, most of these games, you know, obviously they're not all exactly the same, so they, they have different, uh, different different things to comment on but um but this one really is definitely one of the most different and unique indie horror games that i have tried out and so far it's just uh i'm enjoying it even though all i've done is literally walk in a straight well not quite a straight line but kind of close to a straight line um it's still i don't know the the atmosphere and it's building tension because this guy is talking about how we seeing faces in rocks or in the hills, even though I haven't seen any faces. Um, so I don't quite know what this guy's even talking about. I haven't seen nothing. Nothing of concern. This all seems pretty normal to me. Pretty normal moon stuff. Really. Um, seems to be like a, just normal stuff is what's happening. So, um, but as always, That'll change. That'll change pretty quick, I'm sure. Uh, as we get closer to this radar site. Houston, come in. I've made it to the radar site. Over. Roger. Tranquility. <laughs> oh. We need you to assess the condition of the receiver and run a system reboot. After the reboot completes, stand by. I... As we will need to ensure that the reboot fixes the system. But be advised over the last few minutes, almost all lunar installations have experienced significant technical problems. The cause is currently unknown. Over. Hmm. Okay. Um... Understood, Houston. Something about this situation just isn't right. The receiver say? looks perfectly fine to me. No damage at all. Yep. All diagnostics are green, yep. but the receiver is failing to detect any return signatures. Mm -hmm. I'll reboot the system now. Yep, I'll reboot it. Over. Even though it looks normal. Everything looks normal. Roger tranquility. Update us if the situation changes. Over. Okay, I'll update you. Just give me some, uh, give me some peace and quiet real quick. And then... Okay. Here we go. Here it is. Something's happening. Is that it? System reset. Okay, we're resetting. We're resetting the system. This is all normal. True scan. Signature. Signature. Radar is operational. Tranquility. Well done. I'm seeing the scans on my screen oh. right now. 
It looks good. Yep. Um. Looks good to me. Tranquility. Huh? I'm picking up a small object traveling in your direction right now. Okay. It's moving fast. Yep. Very fast. Okay. I cannot get a read on the exact speed. Alrighty. Patching into your HUD now. Do it. Okay. It's 2,250 miles away. Please return to the capsule. That's a long, that's a lot of miles away from me. Okay, wait, oh, 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 it's getting close to me. Oh, it's, uh, it's, it's getting close to me. I see, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's actively moving closer to me. Okay, yep. Uh-huh, yeah, I'm here. We need you to stay where you are. Oh, okay. Please do not move. Okay, sorry about that. You so are safe here. You are safe. You are safe here. We need you to stay where you are. Please do not move. What you, you are safe here. I don't think I am safe. I don't think you're. I don't think you're a good Tranquility, guy. Tranquility, the command yeah. module has begun its journey back to us. Uh huh. What am I doing? Please. Hey. Okay. I'm. Just, yeah. Stay where you are. Stay calm. Nah, I'm not calm. And we will recover you shortly. Nah, I'm good, dude. I'm gonna go back to my. Nope. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to. I'm going back to my my spacecraft. I'm gonna go back to my spacecraft. Where's this music coming from? Where's this beautiful, where's this beautiful music coming from? Okay, well, it's very close, whatever this is. What is this? Is this a meteor? I'm dead, all right. I think I'm gonna die. Hey, all right, what a beautiful sunrise. Okay, okay. The game just shut off. Was that all there was? It's just a giant jump scare at the end of the game? That was a lot. That hurt my head. That hurt my body. Maybe I should just stay. Maybe I should just stay at the place with the radar. Maybe I should listen to the guy when he said I was safe. No, I don't feel like I was. I don't think I was safe. Maybe I should have just trusted him and just stay put. We'll try it. I'll try that. It's 2,250 miles away. All right. Please return to the capsule. Change of plans. We're returning to the capsule because he said return to the capsule and then now, and then he got cut off and then now he's like, uh, now he's a different person. So I don't think we stay there. I don't think we stay there. I think we just book it for the capsule. Tranquility? Yep. Oh, uh, tranquility? Yeah, uh-huh. Tranquility? Yes, I'm here. We need you to stay where you are. Nah. Please do not move. Not doing it. You are safe here. Uh, I'm not. You are safe. Yeah, I'm not. Who? You're lying to me. You are safe here. Yeah. We need you to stay where you are. Not doing it. Please do not move. Oh, I'm moving. You are safe here. Way ahead of you. Way ahead of you, buddy. Tranquility, the yes. command module has begun its journey back to us. Wait. Hmm. Yeah. Stay where you are. Nope. Stay calm. Nope. And we're, we will recover you shortly. Nah, we are way beyond staying calm. We are not. We're not calm at all. Oh my gosh. Can I go faster? Please climb, please climb, please, 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 please climb. Okay, we're doing okay. It's it's still 300 miles away. It's still 300 miles away. Okay, all right, all right, all righty. Keep going, keep going, keep going. We're close. We are close. We are close. We are close. This is the moment. So I'm gonna press E, and then I'm gonna turn around, and I'm gonna book it back to my spacecraft. And we're gonna hope that that is the answer to our problems. Here we go. And we're off. I think it was this way. I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, it was this way, right? Yeah, it was this way. We're just gonna, why am I getting stuck? Why am I getting stuck on this? Really, an invisible wall, huh? Wait, wait, hang on. Nope. Yeah, so I don't think I would have had time. I tried the last time. I tried to uh, to make it back to my spacecraft, but it, I didn't have the time. So I think um, I think I think we just die. I think that's the I think that's the only option. I think the only option is that we die. So I guess that there's no way to live. There's no way to beat the game. I think you just die. But if you guys know that there is another way to, or if there is a way to beat it, let me know. Maybe I missed it. Maybe maybe I maybe I missed something. It's very likely. 
if you guys have watched me for any amount of time, you'll know. I'm not the smartest crayon in the box. So I didn't miss, I missed doing this. Even the week I took off, I really missed, uh, missed making content for you guys. So I'm excited to be back. And I will, like I said, I will take into consideration. I already have taken it into consideration um, that you guys enjoy the, the Unreal 5, the VHS and body cam style horror games more than the other ones. So I will try to focus more on those. But anyway, that, that being said, thank you all so much for joining me for this video for Something Bad is on the Moon. Hope you all enjoyed it. Hope to see you all in the next video. And until then, take care.